loves, this is H Renee coming to you, just doing a quick makeup tutorial. Just a little simple everyday makeup tutorial. Okay, I am done with that. Now I end up um, blending the top part, mixing in a kind of a little warm pinkish tone. Said I wasn't gonna go up there, but I decided to once I was blending it because I wanted to go up a little bit more. Put some more, a little bit of color into it. That one I used was the Warm Rose. <laughs> I got my thing messed up, but the Warm Rose, which is that one. I got my makeup palette dirty when I was getting into that golden light. So clean that up here a little bit. So we're going to use the Too Faced Tutti Frutti Do You. This color is Warm Sand. It's a little darker than my skin tone, but by the time I'm blending and mixing, then it ends up all um, going in. And yes, I use my hands on my face. I just think it's just better for me. But I do end up blending as well. That's my better right there. Some pants up here. So I'm going to blend in actually. So now my foundation is all on. Blend it in with the beauty blender. Then I'm gonna take my Tarte Shape Tape um, Contour Concealer, but it is um, a light medium honey. It's actually pretty light. And normally I like to go in and just do like the T-zone area, get around, you know, like on my nose. But um, I usually like go pretty dramatic, but I'm not going to today. I'm just gonna do a little bit here, a little bit there, there, and just a little bit of a swipe. And then under my eyes, I do. I usually get pretty creative and do it like here. I'm not doing all that today. Just this, that will be for another video. And then this, you just blend, blend, blend. Blend it up to my eye. And sometimes it works for people if they do all the contouring and stuff before they put all their foundation on. The light contour, um, I have tried that before and it does actually work pretty well for me. But today I am doing it this way. And I also put a bronzer on after I'm done to kind of like seal it all so it all looks like it flows and goes together. So even though if it doesn't look all right, right at first, it just takes a while. Blending takes a while to master it with the contour as well. Sure there's 
a lot more blending I have to do. It's also better for me to see with my glasses on. And I use the NYX Matte Bronzer Powder. It's my absolute favorite, and I like to use it pretty frequently. Hence, I am running dry. <laughs> but with the COVID-19 going on right now, I can't go to Ulta. That's where I purchased it from. Can't go there to get it. So I do this, bronze my cheek area. I bring it down here too. Love the bronzer. My skin's kind of like already like a tannish tone anyways, but I like to just warm it up a little bit more, make it a little bit more tanner, especially when I have like a yellowish tone, as you can see, and I'll bring it down here. Cause you want all this to match. You just don't want like the dark line. And not matching. There we go. Then I'm going to use the KKW, her little concealer, and bronzer. Let's see which one do I have here dark highlight or a tan contour. I'm gonna use her tan contour on the sides of my nose. Cause I like my nose to be like a little smaller. So just go like this. Kind of bring it up here a little bit. And then you can even do it with your hand. And just kind of rub it in. Just does it just a little bit. To do that. Okay. I usually bake too. And when I bake, I use the Anastasia, the banana. But not doing that. Not today. That'll be for a different look. This is just a look for me to go. Well, just because I want to look for the day, but also I want to look for, I haven't had makeup on in like over a week and just want to have like, get ready for the day. Got to go to the pharmacy and don't want to look hit for that. <laughs> okay. So that is that. Put on some tiny Kylie Jenner lip matte. And then I will finish up by spraying my face with the settings, uh, the setting mist by Morphe. Also love that brand as well. So this color that I'm putting on by Kylie Jenner, I'm gonna use the lipstick um, liner and then the lipstick. It's a matte and it is called um, Girls Trip. And line my lips, but I'm gonna line a little bit over them and then bring it all the way down same with this I know it's kind of matching with my skin tone right now I normally don't like mattes, but I like hers. But I also um, top it off with like a little bit of a gloss over it, which I know kind of defeats the purpose of a, of, of a matte, but that's just my preference. And I like to do that because my lips tend to get like dry. Thank you. 
Once again, I'm going to speed this up. Okay, so that's that. And then I'm going to use lip gloss. And I also want to put lashes on as well. So, I actually sell lip, um, I don't call them lip glosses, I call them lip drips, but I sell them as well. Uh, my company's name is Bougie Eye. So this says Bougie Eye Lip Drip. I am going to use my color called Sanctuary. It is this one. It's like a light um, iridescent color. So I'm gonna grab one of my testers. This is actually like my personal one, so I'm gonna put that on. And it's just to bring this color out and plus make my lips not dry. And then this is the color if you want to see it swatched on me. You can see it. I love the iridescent. And then I'm going to put on my lashes. My lash of the week right now is Taurus. Show you what those look like. So, Lash of the Week is Taurus. Look really pretty. And I also have. These ones, these ones are really cute. This one's my favorite. This one's called Blended. Kind of goes, fades in from light to dark. So that's the kind that I'm actually gonna put on today. I'm gonna go ahead and use Duo Eyelash Glue and I will come back with a finished look. Okay, so this is my finished look with my lashes on and my eyes, everything. I'm gonna go ahead and finish up with the setting spray. And that is my look. Thank you for watching today. Go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe right there. Thank you.